welcome to Go Engineers video series on quick tips. This is Bruce Kane, technical support engineer at Go Engineer, and today I'm going to show you how to update your standard views quickly and easily. Okay, you'll see the part I have currently in front of us is just a part that has a couple of weird angles on it, just for example here. So I'm going to go, and our current setting is with the front view, right side view, top view. You can see how these are all set currently. And these are mimicked over in the drawing that I've created. You have the front view, the right view, top view. However, I've noticed that all my detail is on this particular face. That would be this face of the part. But it's on an angle, so nothing's in the correct orientation. So I want to switch that to that being my front view. So I'm going to switch back over to the part. And what I want to do is come normal to that face, right mouse click on the face itself, say normal to, it rotates the part. So I'm now looking normal to that face. Once I'm in that area and in the correct orientation that I want to be, hit the space bar, it brings up our view palette. I can click update standard views. When I click this button, it says, what is the standard view that I want to use as my current view? So I want to have my current view set as the front view. So I click on the front view. It says I'm going to change everything else to match that in the orthogonal method. So it will update my top view in relation to this new front view. So I say yes, I want to make the change. Click out of that. Now if I go over to my drawing, my drawing views are now set at front, right, and top. But now this view will allow me to be perpendicular to that view and or normal to that view and I can now dimension it as necessary. So that's the easy way of doing it. Now, the other thing is you gotta be careful because if you come in on some weird angle, if I hit the space bar and say I wanna update my standard view and say the current view I have is my front view and it gives us the same warning about we're gonna change the other views to match. We say yes. Now we jump over to our drawing. It has updated our front view to match that current view. So it is something you have to be careful in what you're doing. Let's go back and change that back. I'll show you how to change that back real quick. Right now I can either select normal to that view, hit the space bar, update standard views and tell it that is what I want for my front view. It will make the change back again. We jump back over to our drawing. It shows them as updated. Find out that's still not what we want. We want to go back to the original. We just come back, jump back over to our view. In this case, our bottom was the correct view that we had that was normal to it. So we can use the bottom or the back because that's the ones that we currently, that currently match the original. So we'll go back to normal, go normal to that view, hit the space bar, update our standard views. That is now the bottom view that we wanted. Say so yes. And jump back over to our drawing and they're now set back to what they were originally. So you can jump back and forth between them, get the view you want. This is Bruce Kane, technical support engineer at Go Engineer, with a quick tip on how to update your standard views. Hope you enjoyed watching it.